Good morning, dear students. Welcome back to English Grammar Classroom. Today we will be dealing with pronouns and its different types. Do you remember what I explained to you about pronouns? What do you mean by pronoun? Pronoun means the word which is used instead of a noun. For example, I, he, you, me, she, him, himself, herself, yourself, themselves, etc. Right? But all these pronouns are categorized under different different names. But which are they? I tell you. There are mainly seven types of pronouns. They are personal pronoun, possessive pronoun, reflexive pronoun, demonstrative pronoun, interrogative pronoun, relative pronoun, and pronoun of quantity or number. But amid this, we are going to discuss only about four types. That is personal pronoun, possessive pronoun, reflexive pronoun, and demonstrative pronoun. Let us check in detail what these pronouns are. A personal pronoun can be said as a short word used as a substitute for a proper name of a person. And these substitutes are I, we, you, they, us, him and so on. Possessive pronoun. Possessive pronoun from the word itself is clear that it shows possession. That means it's owned by someone. For example, mine, his, hers, yours, ours, etc. Reflexive pronouns are used when the action is done by that person or a subject turns back to that person itself. For example, myself, himself, themselves, herself, etc. Now demonstrative pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns are used to point out somebody or something. For example, these, those, this and that. These, those. This is a fish, that is a cat. These are bees and those are roses. This, that, these, those. So I hope now you all are very clear about the different types of pronouns, right? And I have taught you in detail about four types of pronouns, right? So now let us remind once again which are the seven types of pronouns which I told you in the beginning. They are personal pronouns, possessive pronouns, reflexive pronouns, demonstrative pronouns, interrogative pronouns, relative pronouns and pronouns of quantity or numbers. I want all of you to note down all these portions at the back side of your notebook without making any 